हेलो एवरी वन वी ऑल नो अबाउट पार्टीशन एंड देर आर वेरियस वे ऑफ पार्टीशन इन मेमोरी मैनेजमेंट एंड इन दिस वीडियो आई विल एक्सप्लेन यू वेरिएबल साइज पार्टीशन एंड आई एम आयुष भारती फ्रॉम बी सी ए पी पी फर्स्ट ईयर बैच वन एंड बिफोर नोइंग अबाउट वेरिएबल साइज पार्टीशन लेट्स अंडरस्टैंड वॉट इज मेमोरी मैनेजमेंट मेमोरी मैनेजमेंट इज ऑल अबाउट कंट्रोलिंग एंड ऑर्गेनाइजिंग मेमोरी कंप्यूटर्स प्राइमरी मेमोरी which is also known as uh, random access memory or ram uh, it involves allocation and deallocation of programs and processes uh, there are two ways of managing the memory first is contiguous and second is non contiguous and in contiguous there are two uh, two types uh, fixed size partition and variable size partition fixed size partition is known as static partition and variable size partition is also known as uh, dynamic partition so what is variable size partition um, in variable size partition uh, there are no uh, fixed number of partitions are made in the uh, memory whenever uh, which means whenever the processes uh, arrives accordingly uh, we will allocate uh, to uh, we will allocate the space to them uh, let's uh, understand this with an example suppose uh, p1 process p1 of 2 mb has arrived and then there is a free space i will allocate uh, p1 in i allocate p1 for 2 mb and again p2 of 4 mb has arrived in the arrived and we will again allocate p2 in the memory uh, uh, for 4 mb similarly p3 is also arrived and the size of p3 is 8 mb and I, again there is a free space and i will allocate p3 for 8 mb you can see that clearly uh, according uh, whenever the process arrived accordingly uh, i am uh, allocating the uh, process in the memory and suppose p4 has also arrived of 4 mb and p5 has also arrived of 8 mb uh in variable size partition uh, there is uh, uh, there is no external uh, there is an external fragmentation uh, let us understand what is external fragmentation and how, and how it occurs uh, suppose p2 has executed his uh, p2 has executed his process executed his p2 has completed its execution execution and p4 has also completed his ex his execution and there is a space created and this space is also known as hole and suppose p6 process p6 has arrived of size 8 mb so there is a space of 4 mb and 4 mb is uh, is created and if we want to allocate p6 uh, so we are not able to uh, allocate p6 in this uh, two location because it is a continuous continuous uh, memory allocation so there is a uh, there is a case in this case uh, external fragmentation occurs and in uh, variable size partition uh, degree of multi programming is improved because uh, we can allocate a lot of processes in the memory and there is no limitations of process 
uh, we can uh, uh, there is no limit limitations of processes uh, in the memory so that's all about variable size partition thank you